Uh, hello, Alessandro. Hi. How are so, you? Very good. Very good. Um, and you? So I was, I was I'm going. very well. I'm very excited to talk to you today. So mm. we can maybe present uh, uh, the work that you are going to um, be doing in Zagreb as part of the Bespectative uh, project and also about your work in general. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, First of all, I'd like to say just a few words about myself, just, just right. to give a frame, um, which is actually part very, let's say, important uh, in order to, you know, contextualize context project. So I'm, um, I am um, working in the. In the in the in the in the liminal space between uh, visual art and performance, uh, I've been training in uh, painting. Uh, so and uh, all of my practice basically moved around the creation of an image. Painting is uh, is, uh, is let's say the basic of my of my of my entire practice, entire my entire work. Uh, I studied fine arts in Florence. Uh, then I moved. To, uh, I, I start, you know, combining this idea of uh, performing arts uh, and um, and visual practices through, uh, let's say, action painting. So that was my first uh, uh, interaction between performance and uh, and uh, in visual art. And uh, in this relation of uh, you know creating world through world worlds and works uh, through images, I I develop all my entire career like moving in a different uh, uh, space of representation from uh, the gallery to the theater to the city itself. Uh, so finding for each work a different location and different site specific or specific location for uh, the specific works. So I'm, I'm very interested in this uh, uh, specify or, or give uh, to the work uh, the right uh, environment, the right content, the right, the right. And, and the image uh, that you are creating or you started as a painter. So the idea of the image changes or how uh, the image uh, changed for you, uh, what is the image that you are uh, presenting or looking for now? Yeah, I mean, and uh, especially for this work uh, context, which is actually this, uh, let's say, this, uh, it's the, uh, it's the, 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 the end point, the or the end point or the last part of my this long trajectory. Uh, actually, the word, the name of the project, context, is actually embodying this idea. Uh, of uh, relation between visual and performance. Actually, the, the project uh, is actually investigating the idea of uh, context, uh, specifically the etymology of the word context, uh, starting from the idea of uh, the Latin word contextere, uh, that means uh, waving together of, uh, or interweaving together. Uh, and especially I'm interested in the idea of, on, on the reflections that is actually on the continuous relationship between the elements that constitutes the, the context. Uh, and in, especially in this idea of temporary state in which uh, the relation between elements that actually are, are connected together create the meaning of the context itself. Whatever the singular element uh, change uh, uh, all the all the relation between the the entire elements change together. So it's always about redefining the condition of the singularity into a a, a, a relation of possibilities between elements. That and how constitute. do you note that? I mean, do you how do you measure that? How do you how do we see the change? Have you developed you uh, a strategy or a method or you know? Uh, Yes, yeah, st starting from this, I, I started with the idea of, uh, of uh, thinking about uh, um, the idea of mesh. Mesh, uh, not, uh, not a grid. Uh, and uh, this is about uh, feeling the effect uh, between the body of, uh, of, uh, of dancers, of the body of uh, elements that constitute this kind of aggregate. Of, uh, of elements in the, in, the, in the production process. In fact, what I'm, what I, uh, what I, what I'm, what I'm doing uh, 
uh, through the production of uh, context is that uh, to see the production process as a model, as a model of uh, as a system or society or, or in which the production itself is constituted by different uh, elements. Uh, okay. There are the visual, art, the visual elements, there is the performance uh, work, there is an exhibition. This, so this kind of uh, uh, prismatic process that I call, it's made of uh, faces and each face represents parts of this ecosystem or uh, so for example, aggregates of parts. For example, when you come to Zagreb, what is the process? How do you start? Where, you know, how do you map? How do you see uh, the place, the space? So uh, what we're gonna do is basically, uh, practically, we're gonna share time with the local community uh, about, uh, 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 let's say, giving a workshop about this idea of, uh, of method of, of like process of uh, multidisciplinary process of creating uh, uh, different formats. Uh, this would be, um, let's say, a um, uh, first stage. Then we're going to have a relation in the city through the voices of the, of the people. So we're using the the people as a messengers of uh, which they they kind of embodying their own cities. Okay. So uh, in my in my in my research, I I always uh, believed that the body is this some somehow. The, the container of experience that everyone has their own experience of the city and through the workshop this kind of experience is shared and uh, so each each elements of this uh, uh, of this uh, let's say workshop uh, they're gonna share this uh, part of uh, of uh, of their own experience so if we take this uh, the workshop as uh, let's say a uh, aggregate or system or 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 of, of container as a, of experience, uh, we are mutually uh, converting this idea of multi multi experiences into the production, which is a, again a multi 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 faces or prismatic approach itself. Okay. So, and what do you do then with these experiences of uh, of people? How do you translate it then uh, for the viewer? Yeah. For the others to experience it through through your work. So basically, what we are doing, we are using a, a, a geometrical uh, triangles. So the very the, the wooden triangles, uh, generating uh, let's say um, uh, assist uh, let's say a uh, uh, patterns using a, a, a number of uh, black and white triangles positioned in the floor. So we're gonna use. Uh, uh, this uh, let's say matrix, uh, black and white matrix, and uh, working through uh, the combinatorial process of black and white possibilities of this matrix, we're gonna work on this uh, permutation of, of possibilities. So as if we are looking at the community as a permutation of possibilities, we are translating graphically this uh, uh, permutation, visual pattern and visual permutation of the space. So basically, we are somehow representing this combinatorial uh, possibilities of, uh, of ex people experience in the city in a context into our, let's say, context model, which is this matrix, which is this black and white uh, pattern. So the performer somehow are embodying this possibility of uh, permutation of this uh, matrix. So the work is very, let's say, uh graphical and somehow we are projecting this experience into this uh, system which is this uh, matrix which is this uh, uh, system that we will bring to 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 Zagreb. and tell me from, from previous uh, times you have done this uh, when people who took part in the workshop see it do they recognize their experiences in the in the graphics <laughs> in the world well i mean it's uh let's say it's uh, oh, uh, there is no like direct uh, representation. We are working more in this idea of uh, of uh, uh, let's say uh, uh, it, as if I'm I'm represent I'm I'm doing like a map, for example. When when I when I draw my subjective map is completely different from a standard map, right? Mm -hmm. So what we are doing is this this idea of a cartographic process in which. Uh, my own experience is blended with others, uh, other e experiences. And in the, let's say, in the 
uh, final representation, I could I could somehow see some some glimpse of this, uh, uh, but there is no direct experience. Otherwise, it would become like a, a biographical work, let's say. Yes. But but what we are doing is uh, basically uh, trying to play with this idea of permutational process, permutational possibilities, or infinite infinite possibilities of uh, permutation of a system or a city or relation between people in a context. Right. And uh, how long have you been with this idea uh, involved? Uh, about? Uh, this project uh, already like maybe two, three years already, mm -hmm. this idea. And there is always a continuity between uh, uh, all, all, all of my projects have some kind of relation. So whenever something starts, it's already the tale of some, something else. Right. So there is... Uh, the project, uh, the previous project before context, we have been working on a uh, duo. Mm -hmm. uh, and the duo was a reflection of uh, the cartographic process, and context actually is uh, is a tale of that of uh, of that project into uh, into some other forms, basically. Uh, but there is always there is this kind of uh, continuity on of uh, of uh, uh, graphic uh, uh, sign, uh, um, let's say black and white. Still, this idea of black and white that coming back. Uh, yeah. Um, you know, when you talked about these elements uh, influencing one another, there is a big element that uh, happened within the last year uh, that changed everything in relation to everybody's work. So how did that affect, uh, how did the pandemic and the COVID affect? Uh, yeah, I think for me was... Uh, the other elements for the image. <laughs> for me, I, I had this image of a broken glass. Of a broken glass. Of, of a broken glass, in which... Uh, uh, a broken glass in terms of uh, we believed of, of, of our unity or unity of something in the creative process, let's say, of creative uh, production. So we have like a solid plan. The future has a solid plan for everyone. So we, be, we as artists, we had this, uh, we always have this uh, crisis in our, let's say, like we have mini crises all the time. But uh, in terms, in terms of system, in terms of uh, relation with production, we had uh, a well-established line. No? You produce, you have uh, contacts, you, you, you tour. But now, in this kind of change, uh, everything is fall apart. And I have this image of, of pieces in a different sizes. They are not coming back together again. Right. And what we are doing, we are, coming, we are trying to, to combine again those pieces but something else is coming some because you are not able to uh, as a puzzle to find again the right connections and for me this is like a discover of this uh, uh, impossibility to coming back but uh, establish this impossibility of coming back we will find new forms and for me context was like the exact time for me to uh, work on this idea of prismatic uh, process. So having uh, these parts that dialogue together and in these parts, uh, the, the visual approach, the performative approach, the textual approach of the same project, it's actually referring to the, this idea of uh, parts that uh, mm -hmm. as, as ecosystem or like a, a compost, that they like the idea of compost. That's uh, mm -hmm. something that uh, together. In terms of concrete, practical, uh, you know, uh, effects on your process, is, yeah. is it already visible some uh, change or adjustment, or is, is something that will happen for you? Uh, well, I mean, I mean, of course, the 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 we we all had to uh, rethink about uh, the production itself, but the la luckily, my way of working have been always in this. Um, different formats, visual, uh, digital. Uh, I've been, uh, you know, producing uh, uh, videos, uh, producing other things during the pandemic time. But uh, because I have been always uh, with this attitude, I had no difficulties. Of course, the problem was that the I couldn't show so much my work yes. around. I had some, uh, I had to postpone also our, 
our residency in Zagreb has to be postponed one year, actually. Yes. And this stretch time, uh, because uh, of course one year, uh, so the, the project was postponed one year. I mean, in this kind of desert, you always find something. And I have, I'm always this curiosity uh, approach uh, that get, uh, drive me into, you know, unknown lands, I call, uh, in this kind of uh, desert. So it was not, I mean, of course it's bad time, but uh, still, as artists, I think uh, in these voids, in this time, you, you always also find other direction as other opportunities. You know, I'm uh, thinking about this as somebody who produces work uh, from the other uh, side, uh, not as an artist, but a producer and a curator. And I'm thinking, yes, the artists are trying to adjust to new ways of uh, working, but we should also try to think how to uh, uh, get the audience to learn new ways of seeing or new ways yeah. of uh, accessing uh, the world. Yeah. Um, I think I think uh, uh, as a, as a, let's say as a producer, as a distributor, as a festival, as a theater, whatever, we have to start thinking about this multipolarity of uh, assess of the work. So the work is not one piece. Right. So that's yeah. why I come back to this uh, unity. So the, the work is made by pieces. There are, they have different time for reading, they have time of seeing, they have time of different experiences. So a text is completely different. So everything somehow becomes into the same level. A text is uh, important as the body in the, sh in the scene or the body in the... Uh, and I really, I really, I really feel that this is um, um, an opportunity for our organization, which is uh, to try this experimental or this, uh, this uh, more innovative approach. Right. So to feel the work uh, from uh, different po from point different of angles, view, and different, yes. different right. angles. And, yeah. and, and that's why I think uh, uh, it was already natural for me thinking up with this. In fact, context uh, in this way, uh, this kind of multi, multi, multi point of view or multi, the, which I call prismatic work, uh, mm -hmm. and this idea of, uh, or, or, or somehow also like a mineral or like a stone or like a, which you have, uh, you cannot see the completely work for only from one side. My, you you have this approach. You to to in order to discover all the part of this work, you have to move around or you have to look at each face. Right, right. Uh, so that's why I think uh, uh, this maybe would give the opportunity for the audience to go deeper into the work, to explore different parts of the of the piece. Uh, uh, so, and maybe for the artist have more time for, you know, explore a uh, different possibility for the, the project, I mean. Yeah, so okay. it could be a good uh, uh, time uh, uh, off in a way to, mm -hmm. to think of better ways to, to move on, uh, I suppose. Yeah. All right, uh, thank you very much. I think this is it, we have, uh, yeah. I'm very, much looking forward to uh, to seeing your practice. Uh, and yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think uh, we'll have uh, uh, more time to discuss and the, yes. uh, develop these questions together in uh, Zagreb. Thank you. Thanks very much. Thanks you very much. Okay. Ciao.